This embellished t-shirt is fun to make if you're a knitter. The colorful band and pocket are made by knitting strips of fabric. Then the inset band at the neck is a row of so-called yo-yos. I chose a colorful plaid for these additions. There are some good videos of how to make yo-yos. You can find them on YouTube. I'll focus here on how to create the knitted band. You'll need to have perhaps a half yard of fabric to cut the continuous strip for knitting. Cut the strip about one half inch wide or a little more. The diagram shows how, when you are approaching the edge, stop just short and the strip will continue on around the corner, joined in with the next cut across back the other way. You knitters know how to check your gauge. Knit a band to the width of the t-shirt. When you have a band of the right width, you can cut out that portion of the t-shirt and stitch the knitted band in its place. Use a serger if you have one, or zigzag stitch it in place. I did one for the front and the back. I like to have a back that looks good too. The pocket is just a little knit square or rectangle bound on the top edge with a little piece of the fabric stitched in place on the sides of the pocket and the bottom. If you like the embellishment of the yo-yos, make enough to go around the neck opening just under the rib collar band. Hand stitch each to its neighbor at the side to make a continuous band, then cut the shirt where they will be placed, leaving just a bit of material above and below to stitch this band of yo-yos to. In other words, what you cut out for this band will be just a little narrower than the yo-yos that will be sewn there to allow for the seam to join the band to the shirt. For a little extra flair, I added a buckle covered with the same fabric. This is an eye-catching shirt, something plain made special.